Hello everybody, welcome to the Impressa channel. Olympic gold medalist Gabby Douglas is in hot water and people are accusing her of victim shaming. So just to give you all a backstory, Gabby's gymnastics teammate, Allie Raisman, actually opened up about being sexually abused by their team's doctor. And he has abused their teammate, Michaela. This guy has been charged with 22 counts of sexual misconduct and abuse and Ali Raisman opened up about her experience. And I think that's what's important for people to understand is that these monsters are so good at manipulating you. So and Ali said this on Twitter, we are all in this together. If we are going to create change, I need all of your help. She said, just to be clear, just because a woman does a sexy photo shoot or wears a sexy outfit does not give a man the right to shame her or not believe her when she comes forward about sexual abuse. What is wrong with some of you? And when a woman dresses sexy, it does not give a man the right to sexually abuse her ever. Women are allowed to feel sexy and comfortable in their own skin. In fact, I encourage all of you to wear what you feel good in. I will not put up with any women or girl being shamed for wanting to wear a skirt or dress, etc. I do not tolerate it. Are we clear? Oh, and one more thing, stop victim shaming. It is because of you that so many survivors live in fear. Now, Ali's teammate Gabby Douglas replied and said this, however, it is our responsibility as women to dress modestly and be classy. Dressing in a provocative sexual way entices the wrong crowd. Now, this comment got a lot of people upset, including her teammate Simone Bowles. Simone said this, it shocks me that I'm seeing this, but it doesn't surprise me. Honestly, seeing this brings me to tears because as your teammate, I expected more from you and for you to support her. I support you, Allie, and all the other women out there, stay strong. A person tweeted Gabby and said this, and how dare she quote Allie's tweet with a disgusting victim blaming response. Someone who is supposed to be one of your best friends, I'm shocked and disgusted. Gabby replied and said, you misunderstood me, not blaming the victim at all. No man should look at any woman that way. I'm really surprised at Gabby and actually very disappointed because I'm a fan of hers and her statements came off as very insensitive because she knows that her teammate Allie suffered from sexual abuse from their team doctor. So knowing that information, I'm wondering why she would make a comment so dismissive. And a lot of people kind of grow up with this theory or mentality that if you dress a certain way, you invite people to sexually assault you. And that's really not fair at all. You know, there are people who could walk out the house fully clothed and still be sexually assaulted. Do you understand that? Men and women can be sexually assaulted no matter what they wear. And I'm not gonna come too hard on Gabby because her mentality has to change and a lot of people grow up with this type of mentality. I do believe that her statements are applicable to teenage girls, girls who are under 18. They should dress age appropriately, but that's just coming from a protective parental aspect. But if you're a grown woman, you should be able to wear whatever you want to wear without being in fear of being sexually assaulted. And this goes for males too. You should be able to wear what you want to wear without living in fear that you'll be sexually assaulted. So Gabby, you need to educate yourself, baby girl. You have to educate yourself because we're living in a different age and time and you see all these sexual abuse allegations coming out. It's not safe out here. It's just not. So please educate yourself. Anyway, comment down below and tell me what you all think. Please rate, comment, and subscribe and share if you care. Thanks for watching. Bye.